local high school student takes a major step toward winning a prestigious international competition. And our Patricia Vallone has more on this story. Your patient is. So my project is focused on patient bedbathing, and I actually try to simulate patient bedbathing so I can automate the procedure, and so nurses can waste less, waste less time on you know, hygiene parts of the patient and spend more time on actual care. Vinay Rachakonda is hoping his invention will revolutionize the healthcare industry. The 17-year-old Eleanor Roosevelt High School student was just recognized as a 2016 semifinalist in the prestigious Intel Science Talent Search. The teenager is one of 300 in the international competition and the only semifinalist from Prince George's County. Some students will start junior year, but I didn't start till the summer, but he worked tremendously hard. He probably worked 60 hours a week during the summer, and he continues to work that hard. He, in fact, was one of the students who received a stipend for his work this summer from Howard Hughes Medical Institute. Benai comes from a family of engineers, so he says robotics was his natural inclination. What I do is that I have like a mannequin to represent an actual patient. I get one like robotic arm to hold the mannequin and another robotic arm to clean it. And I have at the top a camera, you know Xbox Connect, so those are used to like for, to, for gaming. I take one of those cameras and I detect the stain and then I get a robot to clean it. That's very basic. Yeah. On January 20th, Intel will narrow the competitors down to 40. Those in that select pool will each get a trip to the finals in D.C. and a chance to compete for the top three awards of $150,000 each. From Greenbelt, Patricia Vallone, CTV News. Eighteen Intel semifinalists are from Maryland, and half of those students are from Montgomery Blair High School in Silver Spring. The final judging takes place in March. And good luck to all our participants, yeah. especially those locally. Looks pretty cool. Definitely. We'll